secretaries, he really got off the line very well, made up some places. This time he only had to make up two places. I'm sure that thought is very much at the forefront of Tom's mind as he waits for the lights to come on. We uh, got the green flag waved at the back, 12 laps again, and the engine revs uh, rise, uh, and the drivers looking towards the red lights which go out now, and yes, already Tom Ozzacol is level with Dave Newsham, he's behind Lee Wood, he's got the momentum though, can he get ahead of the offshore venture for pole position? Dave Newsham tucks in behind to get ahead of Matt Jackson, the four of them turn into riches for the first time, so it's Lee Wood, a good start by Lee, he leads then, in second place is Tom Ozzacol in the BMW, getting that one place over Dave Newsham now as they head towards the Montreal head in for the first time, it's the Vectra from the BMW, then the next Vectra in third place, and in fourth place is the, the um, Ford Focus of Matt Jackson. And behind Matt Jackson, we've got the first, oh, off into the gravel has gone. Uh, the uh, number 35, Rob Holland, for the second time, the uh, newcomer, the American driver to the BTCC, not having a very happy weekend. He's off in the gravel. The car doesn't look to be damaged, he's just stuck in gravel. Uh, as the one your head is completely car switched away through Angus TV. Uh, and trying to make up the there, you can see one of the uh, He has got out of the gravel and he's back in the race, but uh, trending along a little bit behind everybody else. Uh, also near the back is the second of the yellow box of entrance, the Chris James car, but out in front, we've got one of them in third place, that's Dave Newsom.